Hey guys, Tyler here today with Groove Life, and today I'm gonna to show you how to adjust your groove belt. To unlatch your buckle, simply push the two ends together, allowing it to unlatch. This gives you access to the excess webbing of your belt. Simply pull it through your keeper loop, hold it in your hand, and you can pull the webbing, and that will tighten your belt. To loosen it, go the opposite direction. You will be able to pull it away. You can see the webbing slipping through the buckle there, allowing it to be a form fit. You might notice that the webbing is pretty stiff when you try to pull it through the buckle, and we designed it that way on purpose. That way, once you find your right size, it never comes loose again, no matter what activities you might be doing, hiking or carrying a weapon, or anything like that. You might find it easier to make smaller adjustments by feeding the webbing directly through the buckle. In order to make it longer, you can take your slack and feeding it through in smaller increments and pulling it through. To make it shorter, do it the opposite direction, pulling your long part of your webbing through and pull the slack out. Once you adjust your belt to your specific size, you can take your excess webbing and feed it directly behind your keeper loop. Even if you have a lot of excess webbing, the keeper loop is designed to slide up or down the belt to hide the webbing securely behind the front of your belt. But in the event you have too much webbing and you're frustrated by how long it is, you can trim the back of this. So if you decide to trim the length of your groove belt, it's important to know that it is not eligible for a size exchange. But all you need is a pair of scissors and a lighter. You're gonna pull your excess webbing out and take your scissors and cut straight across at 90 degrees. And then at a 45 degree angle. This is to help thread the webbing through the buckle a little bit easier. Then you're gonna be able to take your lighter. You see these extra threads here. We're gonna go ahead and just burn those down being careful not to burn yourself. And then once your threads are burned down, you were just gonna take that extra part of the belt and press it down on a hard surface. And that way your cut stays nice and clean. It may not look like a perfect factory cut like we sent it to you, but if you need an immediate adjustment to the size, this is a great option. Thanks for watching our video and keep grooving.